Hey guys, welcome back to Tracy's Place. I'm here with a haul, a kind of a multi-store haul. I got a little bit from here and a little bit from there, but a lot of bit from Dollar Tree. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to tell you where I went. I went to Dollar Tree, I went to Hobby Lobby, and I also went to Walmart. And, oh, Goodwill. So I got the most of the bulk of the stuff from Dollar Tree, so I'm going to start with that. Got a few things here, and I just went again for a couple of things. <laughs> but of course, you can't help it when you go into Dollar Tree. All right, so the first thing that I got was this cute little frame picture. And I'm going to put this in my bathroom because my bathroom is gold, cream, and uh, like a maroonish burgundy. So this will match it perfectly. So I love that. And then I got this one. I couldn't leave this, this one behind. It's like a cream and gold, a little bit of green and stuff in the background, but it, they're just so cute. And I'm going to see if I can put them both in my bathroom. I'll see if they match, see if it looks good together. If not, I might have to just go back and get another one of these. Uh, because where I'm going to put them at on the wall, there's candles hanging. So we'll see. I'll play around with it and I'll see. But you cannot beat that for a dollar. So, and I also got these adhesive diamond wraps. They were a dollar each. So I got two of them and a six inch by 10 inch. So I'm going to be using that for my craft projects. I don't know if a lot of you all know, but I make crafts too. I just hadn't been making a lot of them on this channel. But what I, I make, that's my business actually, um, it's making t-shirts. Before I started with the t-shirts, I did craft, I had a craft business. I still have a craft business. I go to different vending events and sell crafts. So yeah, I kind of got my hand in a lot of stuff. But anyway, <laughs> that's why I have so many things on this channel. Um, it's not just like a, uh, I don't have like a set niche. That's why it's Tracy's Place, because everything that goes on here at Tracy's Place is on this channel, so I do a lot. But these are some reusable gloves, and, uh, you know, just rubber gloves for dishes and stuff like that. I, I don't have my nails done now, but I use these for washing dishes, and some women were surprised, and I'm like, what do you use when you wash dishes? Of course, a lot of women have dishwashers now, but... We have a dishwasher. We don't use it because it's, it's kind of older. It works, but we don't use it. We let the kids do the dishes. Creates a great work ethic. Bill's character. <laughs> but we let them do the dishes. And uh, then I do the dishes also. So, uh, let's see. I have this. This is going to go in my YouTube planner that I'm making. And it says, get it, girl. You can do it. Beat your fears. Let go and stuff like that. So that's going to go in my YouTube planner. And this is going to be for to hold my receipts and also pens. So that every time I want to write in my planner, I don't have to go find pens and stuff. I'm going to put it here. And then also keep my receipts for my channel in here. When I spend money on mukbangs or even the DIYs and different things I do for the channel, Put them in here. That way when tax season comes, they'll all be right together and organized. Um, I'm going to be keeping them in order by date and everything. So I'll be ready. I will be ready. The next thing I have is this Clar and Danver liquid hand soap. This is very delicious. Hopefully you can see that, but this smells really good. And I have red accents in my kitchen. So this is going to be on my kitchen sink. You know, you want to wash your hands in the kitchen. That's going to be in there. I like stuff to be matchy matchy. Mm -hmm. um, these are scrub buddies, just, um, you know, scrubbing sponges. And they have like a little indention here so that you won't mess up your nails if you're doing it with just your bare hands if you're cleaning with your bare hands but i like to use my rubber gloves when i'm cleaning too because i do my nails myself and i don't want to mess up my manicure so and i, I even know people that um, go to the nail shop of course you don't want to mess that up because you pay a lot of money for it so get y'all some rubber gloves get some rubber gloves okay 
And also from the Dollar Tree, I got some tissues, some puff tissues. But the box is navy blue and white. Like I said, I'm matchy-matchy. My son, this is for my son's room. His room is basically navy blue and gray. But um, and I, don't even, I think I did a room tour for him when I redid his room. Um, anyway, it's navy and gray. So navy and white will match just fine. I have a coupon holder. This is for my grocery coupons. And... It has separate sections, and you can put, I guess, for like, if you want to separate it into frozen items, um, freezer items, or, you know, whatever you want to do. Put that down there. And I got these sticky notes. And I will probably, you all, I will probably be putting these, you know, like when you go running your errands, when you have, like, seven places to go once you head out of the house i will probably be using these to just stick on the dashboard of my car i kid you not because sometimes you know you get out and you're like Dang, what, what was i supposed to go get from so and so or where was i supposed to go i'm gonna write down all the stores if i need to go to the post office to wherever it'll just be written down here and that's that i'm sure i'll be using it for other stuff too and these are five tab what is called dividers and these will most likely go in my youtube planner that's what i bought them for move my glasses out the way and you all i got placemats why tracy did you get placemats i got placemats because these are going to be a craft project. I probably won't even say what I'm going to. I'm going to surprise y'all. But I got three placemats. Brown one, a gold one, and a black one. And they will be craft projects to be announced. TBA or TBD. To be determined. But I know what they are already. But I don't want to say right now. But those are going to be craft projects. DIYs. And also from the Dollar Tree, this wasn't a small haul from the Dollar Tree this time. Okay, I have these Werther's Original Soft Caramels. I love these soft caramels. They are so good, so good. I will probably be drenching some of them. I'm going to try putting them in some semi-sweet chocolate chips melt chocolate chips and dip them in there and see how they come out so i am excited about that also in the snack aisle i have some honey roasted peanuts i like these these are so good so good i think it was um sister fifi i believe on her channel i think she was um doing a mukbang and she was drinking a pepsi or a coke i'm thinking of pepsi with peanuts in it and she was saying that her mom did it and my mom did it um when coming out when i was coming up and everything and i never tasted i don't think i ever ever tasted you know how you see people do stuff people that are close to you like my mother and father did so many things and i i, I never tried it they do it all the time they're from the south and i just thought i all growing up I'm like oh that's a southern thing you know but I never had the urge to even try it when she was doing it. But I'm going to try it. I'm, I know probably not with the roasted, the um, honey roasted peanuts. I'll probably get some regular salted peanuts and do it and see what all the hoopla is about. I'm sure it's good. I sure it's good. Um, got y'all. Have y'all tasted these Nico, Nikot or Nico? These are the peanut butter ones. These are so good. These are good, good, good. The cookie on the outside has this kind of a sweet flavor. It's, it's not just a regular cookie. And it is just so good. Although y'all know I'm trying to give up milk, so I'm perplexed on what I'm going to drink with it. Because I, I drink milk with so many different of my snacks. And so now I'm kind of 
little upset about that because that the almond milk you know like i said it was it's decent but it ain't nothing like the taste of cow's milk because we even got used to it anywho clark and danver apple fills this is the refill bottle oh my goodness this i have been getting for years from my kitchen for uh hand soap in my kitchen my kitchen used to be green and green red and white and oh i gotta smell it right now this is so good just just fresh apple smell a good old fresh apple smell i also picked up this fresh lemon and mint from soft soap and this is a limited edition it says and that oh my goodness i love the smell i didn't smell it in the store i'm gonna smell it right now i hope i like it because you all know i love lemon so this has lemon and mint oh that smells good that's a nice little combination lemon and mint so that smells really good and i got these well this i only got one oatmeal and verbana soap you all know that's one of my favorite soaps so i have that and I saw this on Miss uh, Living Life, wait a minute, Life of Steph Vlogs. That's uh, someone I watch a lot. Y'all go check her out. I'll try to write her channel name right here also. But she was doing a What's in My Purse video. And she said she carried uh, intensive cream, this Dove cream. And I had not tried it before. So, oh, it has a seal on it. Well, that's good. That's good. I'll try it. I was going to try it on camera. Let's see if it comes open real. Yeah, it comes open easy. Hmm, it has a nice, it's not strong smelling or anything. But, oh, that's, that is soft. I like that. That's nice. Thank you, Steph. <laughs> I like that. I can't wait to put it all over my hand. That's a nice feel. Nice feel. Okay, I think that was all from Dollar Tree. So, I am going to move on to Walmart. And I only got two things from Walmart. And I am making a binder for my YouTube, not a binder, I'm sorry, a YouTube planner. Not a binder. I mean, it is a binder, but this is this is really a planner. And I wanted to get a planner, you know, already made and everything. But it just, the ones I saw in the store just do not have the things I need for YouTube. So I will be bringing you this YouTube planner because I don't know if you all know, I've made like three binders before and I use these binders. I have one home management binder. I have um, a, a binder for my business. And then I have a binder for Jalen's college things. I was doing her scholarships and different stuff like that. So this is a binder, but it's also mostly a planner because this is going to be used for my YouTube business, period. And this will be used also to plan my videos, jot down notes about my videos that I have coming up. Because you all, when as you grow, you are going to find it. You have to be organized. You have to be organized. And I've been saying this a couple of months that I was, you know, in the process of getting organized. And this is the final step. It's making a planner, making it official. And so I'm going to be um, showing you um, how, I guess I'll do a how to make it. And then I'll go over it also. And then um, I'll be doing a, a YouTube. Somebody asked me to do a, like how I got to. 15,000 subscribers so I'm a little bit past that now so I'll be doing a um I don't know what the title will be but basically YouTube tips on growth and different things that I've learned and um you know over the past especially the past couple of years because the growth really happened like over the past year and a half and um I've learned a lot of things so I'm going to share it with you but I'm going to go over the binder and I'm going to also make a YouTube tips video anyway I got this from Walmart. I didn't end up getting it from Target. I got this from Walmart. I initially saw a whole bunch of these at Target. And I left and didn't get them that day. And I always thinking that Walmart is cheaper. I don't think it was that much cheaper if it was at all. But anyway, it's a heavy-duty binder. 
and it has these big, it has like four pockets in it. It has one, two, and usually binders have pockets that are low like this. I, I wanted these large ones, the tall pockets. So that's that. And then I also have this five tab insertable style, um, th these plastic dividers. And I'd gotten some from Dollar Tree. I gotten some from Dollar Tree, but I saw these at Walmart after I went to Dollar Tree and I like these better. They're curved around here. And remember, yeah, I was telling you all that Dollar Tree is awesome and everything, but don't always get caught up on everything in Dollar Tree because some things are more expensive, even though it's a dollar. So these were 69 or 79 cents at Walmart and they, to me, I, I like them better. I just like the design and style of them better. And they were cheaper than the Dollar Tree. So that's that. And also I went to Hobby Lobby and I got some of the materials for my binder. So I'm gonna show you if they had a sale. So if you all make a binder, and as I understand, this is supposed to be a standard sale but these are regularly 69 cents a piece. The, the um, paper, the decorative paper, I bought four and the sale is buy four, get them for a dollar. So I'll be showing you what I do with these in the video. And then I also got more paper, more of the craft paper. And so I'll be, this is what I got. They were $1.99 each with 50% off. They had a good sale at Hobby Lobby. And then also I got these. These were 49 cents with half off. These papers here. So I got six of these. I won't pull them all out, but I got six of these. So they ended up being 25 cents each. So... I love decorative things. I lo love to make fancy things. So my binder is going to be, my planner is going to be, you know, all decorated and everything. <laughs> so that's that. All right. And of course, I had to get a bargain bargain. I went to Goodwill and it wasn't one of their sale days. Um, I just went because I was near there. And even though it was not a sale, this was still a good price. You, oh, look at what I got. Now, I know everybody might not like this style, but I don't know if you can see this, but this is a good quality bag and good heavy hardware. I don't know if you all can see that, but this is a good bag. Nice bag and it has the straps here. Well, one strap there anyway. And... Kind of shaped like a medicine bag almost but i love that i love that shape that rounded kind of shape and it was six dollars it wasn't on sale but y'all this is it doesn't even look like anybody used it it is like brand new it doesn't, didn't have the tags on it this time or anything but it looks brand new on the inside and the outside it's very sturdy has the straps that come up like this. Oh, and I've been looking for a gray bag because I have more fancier bags for church when I'm wearing silver and gray, but just like for every day, like if I'm, you know, wear, have on gray shoes or black shoes and I'm accenting, accenting it with gray or silver or whatever, I wanted a gray purse and I found one, $6, this is so cute. The name on it is Jewel, J-E-W-E-L-L. -L. I don't know how famous or not it is. It don't matter to me. I'm not really just into name brands it's like that. If it is, fine. But if not, fine also. <laughs> but anyway, that's that. So I'm so excited about that. Oh, it has a pocket on the inside, big old pocket on the inside. And it says Jewel on it. And then it has another pocket on, two other pockets on the other side. Big enough for me to slip my phone down in. And yeah, I like that. I like that. Anyway, all right, guys. So that is it. 
That is it. Dollar Tree, Goodwill, Walmart, and Hobby Lobby. So, I had a good little shopping day. All right, guys. Love you all. I'll see you next time right back here on Tracy's Place. If you are new here, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. That way, when I upload, you'll see it right away. It does not cost anything to sign up for a YouTube account. Not anything. It's just like Facebook or anything else. You just make an account. That way you can comment on people's videos and different things like that. Thumbs up and do, you know, just do all that stuff. Um, so anyway, yeah. And share this video. Share it with somebody who you think may like to see it. All right. Be blessed. Bye.